Okay, gonna do a quick little tutorial on how to overclock a Ryzen 3. Sorry, I'm gonna try my best to stop shaking. There. Uh, so we, the quickest way is just to hit Game Boost right there up the top left hand corner, and that will give you uh, a slight game improvement. Now for me, I went out ahead and did something, something much higher. Uh, what you do is you go over here to your CPU ratio, 3.8. Point zero zero, or sorry, three eight point zero zero, is completely safe with the. Uh, here, I'm actually going to change this over to three point nine, and then you switch your volt to one point three zero zero, and then it should be good to go. And then what you're going to do is just save. So you can just click exit, and it's going to ask, "Do you want to save?" You just click yes and then if it works it will load up your computer and then you just keep an eye on the heat so you don't need to download anything special to do this it's pretty straightforward you just change those two things uh, the game boost is a safe way to do it if you don't feel comfortable changing around everything and then the other way is to actually manually change everything even in upping it to a 3.7 makes a huge difference uh, I've heard of people getting away with four but I don't know if I would trust that, so now, just to make sure it actually worked, see if I can get back into it. I may have clicked it a little too late. Now the crappy part about using a Ryzen is that if it wasn't accepted, you have to take out that little battery on the motherboard if you get the black screen of death, and then that will automatically restart it. Take it out, just leave it on top of your computer for like 5-10 minutes, and then put it back in, and it will do a complete reset. Just make sure to unplay it first, but essentially that's all you have to do.